Never do this in your app, please. You can do a lot of bad things and get away with them, but this one can be really dangerous, especially for your pocket. So put up a little note above your screen or in your workplace and write on it, your API keys are not safe in a native app. They just don't belong into any kind of front end facing project because people with enough criminal energy will be able to get to your API keys and you know what happens. So if somebody gets your OpenAI or your Gemini key, you're in for a big surprise when the next bill comes. There's always a way to somehow decompile an app. I tried this before in a YouTube video and I got easily to a couple of OpenAI keys in application. You can always decompile the bytecode and you get that. If you include your API key as a string in your application, it will be part of the bundle and people will be able to get to it. So even if you're using like React Native and you have a .env file, it's not a safe place. There's one exception to this that I will tell you in a second. But that environment file, it's still used in your project and it will be still included in the code of your application. So the only exception to this is if you're using Expo API routes in your project. In that case, the key, if they are not prefaced with Expo public in that key, in that file, will actually be only used in a server side environment for API routes. And that's also the only fix you can do to use API keys in your project. So you want to bring up something like a cloud function or you have to spin up your own server as a little proxy and only allow connections from your app to the proxy. You can also have rate limiting in that API. And in there, in that server side environment, you can have your API keys. But please do me a favor put up that note that says your API keys are not safe in a native app. If you want to see more on how to structure your application to make it more secure, let me know in the comments and don't forget to follow along for more tips.